Hello friends, welcome back to another video. So in this video, we'll make RGB LED panels controlled via Wi-Fi. So for this project, we need an ESP8266, mini breadboard, an IR LED, a 220 ohm resistor, RGB LED strip set with the remote, converter, LED strip and charger. Then we need 6 hexagons with each side of 8 cm. and we'll make it in this pattern now we need 6 cardboard strips of length 48 by 2.5 cm these cardboard strips will be used as borders for each of the hexagon Now let's take the LED strip and test it out with the IR remote given in the set. The one which I'm using is a 12 volt LED strip. You can also get 5 volt LED strip in market. Make sure the IR remote and the controller is close together. So yeah, it's perfectly working. Now let's move to our ESP8266. The code and the circuit diagram with all libraries is attached in the description. Now come to your Arduino ID and put the correct Wi-Fi credentials. And then go to tools, select your right board and the port. And then hit the upload button. Once the code is uploaded, go to your serial monitor and press any of the buttons in the ESP8266. And then you will get your IP address. Paste this IP address in your browser. Make sure that the receiver and the transmitter are close to each other so that the IR LED connected to the ESP8266 can communicate properly with the receiver of the RGB LED strip. Now go to the link copied and you will get your virtual remote. From this you can control your RGB LEDs from any part of your house within your Wi-Fi range and the same Wi-Fi connection. Now make the borders of each of the hexagon in this manner. Now take a foil and cut in a hexagon shape of each side 8cm then crumble each of the foil in this way so that there is enough light coming out. Do the same thing for each of the panels.
then cut small slots from which we can pass the LED strip from one panel to another. Do the same thing for each of the panels. Now take a thermocol plate and cut it out in this manner. Do the same thing for other panels too. Then take the LED strip and stick it internally of each of the hexagonal panels. Now place all the thermocol covers in this way. Now slowly our project is coming to shape. So this is the connection I have done here. The ESP8266 is connected to the 5V adapter. Now let's see our project in action. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to Vikram Tech and hit the bell icon to get the latest notifications. See you in the next video.